Basic analysis that you can use for your Likert scale variable is by using the mean and the total. The problem is, most people tend to bring the data into Microsoft Excel, do the calculation there, and then get back to SPSS, bring the data into SPSS, and then do the further analysis. Actually, SPSS also provides the feature so you can compute these variables easily. I will show you how. In this worksheet, I have six variables that consist of one categorical variable named gender, one continuous variable named age, and also four Likert scale variables, start from text, texture, smell, and crunchiness variable. This is a fictitious survey that I made to measure the satisfaction level of a product. And as you can see, I have 100 records here, and we will try to analyze these Likert scale variables using the mean and also the total function. Let's take a look at the variable view. This four variable is already measured in the ordinal measurement. Then, let's compute the mean variable first. Go to transform and then select compute variable. Here, at the target variable field, let's type the new variable name. Let's just make mean as the name. Control A and then copy it by pressing Control C. And at the type and level field, just paste the variable name as the label. Click continue and at the numeric expression field, let's type the function here. And I prefer to use the provided function by SPSS, select the statistical, and then click min below the function group field, and then hit the arrow button to move it to the numeric expression field. Then just delete the question marks in the bracket, then move the variable to the bracket, click the variable, and then hit the arrow button, comma, again, select the variable that you want to uh, summarize, Okay, let's uh, fix this by using comma, close the bracket, and then click OK. Let's take a look at the data view window, and you have a new variable named mean that consists of the average of these four variables. Like this, uh, you have the all mean for all records in your data view window. Next, let's compute the total of the variable. Again, go to transform, and then select compute variable. Here. Let's change the target variable to the total and then Ctrl A and press Ctrl C. Just paste it into the label uh, field and then click continue. And then add the numeric expression here. Let me delete all of this so we can make it uh, easy to interpret. And then at the statistical, click sum at the below function group, double click it, and then delete all question marks in the bracket, move all variables that we want to create as the total, double click it, comma, again, just uh, move the variable to the bracket, all of them that you want to make as a total, okay, everything is good, and then click OK. Let's get back to the data view window, and you have a new variable name named total, and this is the total of the four variables, you can see the test, texture, smell, and crunchiness, the total of the score of these four items is uh, 7. And at the variable view, let's uh, fix the measurement like this. This is the scale, and also this is the scale variable. Great, that's all. See you in the next video.